Am I the arsehole? For having a dry wedding and serving only water for drinks? Throw away only cause I don't want this on my main. Okay so basically my husband and I are getting married later this year. Each of our sides of the family are fairly big. It will be around 100-150 people total. My husband and I are paying for this all ourselves, as well as my grandma who said she doesn't care one way or the other on this issue. She just loves weddings. We have a lot of kids in our family so we decided against making it child free but we did decide to make it dry. So there will be no alcohol of any kind at our wedding. Honestly, this doesn't have anything to do with there being kids there but due to the fact that my fiancé and I don't drink. Nothing against people who do, it's just not for us and we don't want to. On top of that, we only really drink water. We rarely, if ever, drink soda so most of the time it's only water with the occasional juice and milk. We don't even drink coffee. So obviously the food which is a part my grandma is not paying for is going to be expensive for that many people. We are having our wedding catered so everyone will have a good choice of food to choose from but to drink only water will be provided. We don't want to have to pay for alcohol or soda, it is just an large added expense when we can just do filtered water for a much cheaper cost. Well, when family and friends found out being got angry. Some didn't really care but some are really upset about it. Saying that I can just have an open bar so I don't have to pay for drinks we could, but still have to pay for the bartender and we just really don't want to bother with alcohol there. Or we should at least have soda because how can we expect everyone to drink only water? The kids will be upset. The wedding will be boring. That this is not how weddings work. Etc. So am I the arsehole? I didn't think this would be a problem it's only water. I mean, don't most people drink water every day anyway? Should we pay the extra to have soda to make the family happy? I hope that in 20 years everyone's still saying you remember that wedding we had to smuggle in a 2 litre of Pepsi. Sounds pretty brutal. How will they wash down their saltine and lettuce entrees? You're the asshole. This is so bad it's funny. If you're not having alcohol, offer a variety of nice beverages to choose from, soft drinks, iced tea, a signature virgin cocktail, coffee tea with dessert. If you cannot afford to properly host your guests, then you may in fact have too many guests. Or you need to cut costs in other ways. But treat your guests as though you actually want them to be there. As someone who only drinks water and the occasional tea, you're the asshole. Not about making the wedding dry. That's perfectly fine. But damn, give people some options to drink. Some carbonated water if anything. I wouldn't necessarily say you're the asshole but your wedding sounds boring and I wouldn't want to go. You're the asshole I don't have anything against dry weddings but surely you can offer something other than just water. Ice tea? Lemonade? Something with flavor? When my cousin had a dry wedding she served sodas. Your guests are not likely to think it's very celebratory if you just serve water. And you would be surprised by the number of people who never drink water, let alone do it at celebrations. You're the asshole, not due to the no alcohol rule. I like drinking, but I can very much have a nice evening without it and whoever doesn't, should check if they have an alcohol problem. I think you're the asshole because only water, no soda, no juice, no coffee is totally bland and boring. Why do you even invite people? Why marry with so many guests at all? Just let it be the two of you and drink your boring water and yes, I think of myself as a hydro -ami, but also as someone who loves having guests and spoiling them. Listen, it's your wedding and you can do what you want. But also, you're hosting an event. Not having alcohol is one thing, but not even having coffee, soda, or tea? It feels cheap and inconsiderate, so for that, you're the asshole. I have to say you're the asshole, not because of the no alcohol, that's fine to make that call, but to only serve water? That no. You really need to have something other than water for people to drink. A collection of soda flavors is a bare minimum. I wouldn't call you an asshole, 
just a shit wedding. People are gonna talk, call you cheap, think you're weird. The no alcohol is weird enough, but just water, LMFAO. People are gonna walk out early. You're the asshole. While it is your wedding, you are also the hostess. Not bringing soda or juice is why you're the asshole. Have a cash bar between the wedding and reception if alcohol bothers you that much. You'll be busy anyways taking pictures and won't notice. Unsweet and sweet tea wouldn't be expensive at all and is a bit more traditional. Yeah. Don't skimp on things that will make your guests comfortable. We generally only drink water, but anytime we have guests over for anything we also have soda or at least lemonade or tea. It's just being a good host. You're the asshole, not for the dry part but for not doing any other drink options besides water. Are you an ar- No. Does this sound like the worst wedding ever? Yes. Look your wedding, your choice and all that jazz but this is one party I would actively avoid. I wouldn't be upset I just wouldn't come. Any who slain an ah. You're the asshole slightly. Cash bar would include soda, but if you want a dry wedding, at least have coffee, punch, and iced tea. You don't have to pay for much, but it does make it a little nicer. You're the asshole. I can understand not offering alcoholic beverages, but not even juice or soda? No mocktails or anything like that? It's a bit fucking odd. NT only if you are cool with everyone leaving the moment it is socially acceptable to do so and not a minute later. Soft you're the asshole. No juice, or pop. My friend did a dry wedding and I just got Shirley Temples essentially, which I love. Ultimately it's your decision, but I'd be bummed at water only as a guest, crying face. You're the asshole for the water. Why not just do biop? Your wedding will probably be remembered for years but not in a good way. You're the asshole just elope and you can save even more money. But, uh, not having alcohol is reasonable. You're having a lot of guests, so you should take them into consideration with an open bar. But nothing to drink but water. Do you really not mind being the wedding that people will remember as cheap and not considerate of guests by only serving water? I don't drink alcohol and I enjoy drinking water all day long. However, I'd never do that to guests at any event or party I was hosting. I definitely wouldn't do that to my wedding guests. You're the asshole. People are going out of their way to celebrate your day, traveling, taking the time to look nice, buying you gifts and giving cash etc and you can't be bothered to at least serve them some yummy options other than water. Coffee, tea and a few soda selections would be completely appropriate for a dry wedding. I wouldn't come just because it's clear that you have zero respect for the comfort and pleasure of your guests. For shame.